What's up guys, it's DJ Beanpole here to review for you something that just randomly showed up on my doorstep. I didn't win any contests, it wasn't a prize, it was no promo I was picked to log on. I received from Purist Labs themselves, Noxygen. And it just showed up on my doorstep with a letter written inside of it that said, tell us what you think. Well, it's been a while since I've received that package, and I apologize to the Purist fellows for not having this done soon enough, but uh, it's been awfully busy in my household. We are uh, expecting a baby in a couple months, so uh, with the news of that coming around, things got a little hectic around here. So workout slowed down just a little bit, and uh, I did not want to give a review for Noxygen until I had at least gotten a handful of workouts with it. Let's talk about what's in Noxygen. Well, let's actually look, let's look at the claims. It says on here that Noxygen is a novel stimulant free. This is stim free, so this is good for those of you who are maybe wanting to not use stimulants at all or want to work out later in the evening and you want to be able to go to sleep and you don't want to be involved with stims. Uh, designed to create an oxygen sparing environment through enhancing vasodilation and blood flow with nitrotine while simultaneously volumizing muscle cells and increasing body mass, lean body mass, with Hydromax, which is uh, their form from uh, glycerin. So we're looking at the nutrition facts here, the supplemental facts. Serving size is 2.8 grams, and there's not a whole heck of a lot going on in this little bottle. Uh, it's 1.5 grams of sugar alcohol, so there's your little source of carbs right there. There's only 65 milligrams of sodium. And for those of you that don't know why sodium was just included in here, this is not very much sodium. I mean, you could go eat some saltines and probably take more sodium than what's in this. However, sodium, wherever salt goes, water follows. So this is going to start pulling water. When you take some sodium before you work out, it'll start pulling the water and pushing it into wherever the sodium goes. So for your workouts, this is helping with pumps. It has a NO3 TMG blend. NO3 is nitrate. And TMG is trimethylglycerin, also known as betaine. Uh, it's also it's a 740 milligrams of that. And the it's real easy to use. You just take one scoop, and you can take it by itself if you want. I wouldn't recommend that because it doesn't. This is unflavored. It doesn't really taste like anything. But you can also mix it with any pre-workout of your choice. Now I've tried it with a bunch of different pre-workouts. I tried it with Evol. I tried it with uh, Stimaholic. I tried it with Speed X3. I tried it with. Uh, I'm trying to think. I actually had a sample of Condense that I tried it with. Um, I tried it with a bunch of different things and the results were always the same. Um, I use this as a source of my glycerin to help with ARA uh, supplementation because those two mixed together, the glycerin works as an emulsifier, helps uh, um, compound the effects of erichondric acid which also helps with pumps so I mean this has its versatility in almost everywhere you can use it for strength training you can use it for endurance training it tells you exactly what to do on here for both of those do you want to use it for strength training throw it in with your pre-workout shake it up drink it go to town you want to do endurance training put it in your uh, intro workout or put it in like your Gatorade your Powerade uh, your amino drink mix it up and sip on it as you're doing an endurance workout the one thing I noticed from Oxygen right away, now it says on here that it is oxygen sparing. Now I'm not exactly sure what that means. Is It's oxygen sparing because of vasodilation, uh, because there are there are some pump products in here, especially with the, uh, the sodium and the sugar alcohols, uh, and the betaine is definitely going to help um, open some things up. The nitrates too, big for pumps, but as far as oxygen sparing, I'm not quite sure what that terminology is supposed to mean. The amount of oxygen in the atmosphere right now is at 21%, 21%-ish. Um, so just because you are using oxygen doesn't suddenly mean that not as much oxygen into your body is using. It's not going up or down. The level's still still the same. You're still breathing room air, regardless. Now, what I think that they were trying to get at here when they're saying oxygen sparing is that you're not needing as much of it. Your muscles aren't requiring as much to do the same amount of work you usually would do in the gym without this, is what I think that they're they're getting at there. Um, and so what I was expecting when I took this product was I was gonna see if my breathing was any different. I was gonna see if my endurance was any better. 
if I could breathe easier. Now, the first time I took Noxygen, I actually took it by itself. Surprisingly, I had a hard time breathing. I, my chest started to feel a little heavy. Um, I wasn't sure what was going on, if this was like a side effect from taking it for the first time. That never happened again after taking it with anything else. Every single pre-workout I took it with, I even took it with some non-stim stuff. So an oxygen's non-stim by itself. I took it with a couple other non-stim products, Pump X3 and High Volume. And I've taken a lot of those a lot before, so I was very familiar with the feelings of how it would be from working out. Noxygen compounded the effects from the pre-workouts. Pumps were greater. Pumps were bigger. Pumps lasted a lot longer, not only throughout the workout, but after also including post-workout. I'm talking about like into the next day, waking up, still feeling big, still feeling pumped. Uh, endurance in the gym, besides that first day, which didn't go very well for me, adding oxygen into my pre-workouts, endurance was increased. Um, rest periods were down, endurance was up. Um, as far as strength, nothing really attributed to big increases in strength. Nothing then here from Noxygen anyway that I would attribute to any increases in strength. Um, this is just an all around good pump product. If you're looking for uh, a product that increases your endurance a little bit, increases your pumps in the gym. If you're flying solo, you're looking for something that might make breathing a little bit easier. And when I say make breathing easier, I say meaning your endurance has increased. Um, where you're able to do the same amount of work, you're able to put your muscles on the same amount of stress, and they will respond better, you'll respond better, you won't be so out of breath in between each set, then Noxygen is something for you. Um, the purest guys have blown me away in the past, not only with their generosity for me to log their products, but also with their products just by themselves. Condense, amazing pre-workout, Amino D, amazing great tasting um, amino acid product, and now with Noxygen, they are starting to fill the gaps in some of all the different facets of the supplementation world. And uh, Noxygen, if you've never tried it before, it will do something amazing for your pre-workout, whatever it is. I don't care what you're taking. You might be taking something from the Arnold line, Muscle Farm. Um, it doesn't matter what it is. Add one scoop of Noxygen to it. I haven't gone above one scoop. Maybe I've done one and a half scoops. Um, and you're going to be blown away at the difference of how well you're better you're better able to perform whether it's weightlifting, whether it's cardio, whether it's an endurance workout. I mean, I'm talking you could take this, go for a 20-mile bike ride, and you probably would have less time getting winded than you would compared to not taking anything at all. The one thing I will say about Noxygen when you first receive it, and I had to ask a rep about this because I thought something was wrong with mine, I thought some moisture had gotten into the bottle, is that it is actually, it looks very lumpy. It's almost Dippin' Dots type of ice cream look. And I thought, if you ever had a pre-workout delivered to you in a tub, if that there's no moisture packet in there and you ever get a product and some moisture has gotten into it, it sucks everything up and it makes it look like Noxygen looks. This is normal. This is part of that NO3 TMG mixture. This is part of the GMS, the, gl the glycerin that's in there. And I actually have some in here. I want to show you guys what I'm talking about. So... Let me hold the camera here. The scooper, so it's only 2.8 grams per serving. It's not very much. The scooper is very small. The bottle itself is very small. Here's the scooper, and it's still got some of the noxygen on it. So I, I forget what the phrase was. I saw it somewhere in an advertisement where if, you, if you're not clumping, then I forget what, what the rhyme was. But this is what it looks like. Okay? It looks like batter almost, like dry, stuck together pancake batter. This is what it is supposed to look like. So if you order it and this is your first time, you're ordering it because of this video and you see it and it comes and it looks like this, that's what it's supposed to look like. You take it, throw it into your shaker cup, it dissolves almost right away. Shaking it up, it goes right away. Like Put it with your pre-workout, you won't even know what's in there. It's unflavored uh, and your workouts will benefit greatly from this. Purist Labs, um, I'm not sure who sent this to me on the um, card that you guys asked for me to review. I couldn't read the name of the handwriting. So whoever sent this to me, thank you very much for giving me this opportunity. Once again, for all you out there on YouTube, I was blown away at the generosity of this company. Uh, and they have proved themselves to me time and time again. Excellent products. Fantastic, outstanding customer service. You heard it here from DJ Beanpole. You can see me on DJBeanpole.com. 
Purist Labs and Oxygen, highly recommended.